but it was awesome like it was a nice introduction to like getting comfortable singing because Talia and I would just like go into this little room in the band room and like she would play and I would sing and yeah I think from there we decided we wanted to do like a benefit show um for the women's shelter so we did like a Christmas show at Zach's at the time which is now the Vic and Cameron um we put on this show and I got some people from SKSS in my grad class to perform and I think we raised like 500 bucks or something which was pretty cool and that was just off cover which was nice um, and then, yeah, so that was like the first show I ever played was with me, Talia, and my friend Jared Putnam. And it was so like, I remember, <laughs> I remember sitting up there and I just was like, I'd always loved singing and like, I, but I'd never like done it like that in front of most people. And I'd also never sang into a mic before. And like, even practicing, I didn't sing into a mic. But like, when you sing into a mic, there's a slight delay in your PA that you hear back. I remember I started singing and like then I heard my playback and I was like so I was like oh my god so I just like just like blindly went through this whole set and it was like I remember like I had to we sang um have yourself a merry little Christmas is our Christmas song and there's like a pretty high note in it and I think I like botched it pretty bad and, like but it was definitely like it didn't it didn't discourage me though I, I kept playing music but that was the first time and it was very special and people were so supportive and I remember the feeling of doing it I was like oh like this is what I'm meant to do. Like, I felt like I never had a thing. Like, I didn't play sports. I didn't, like, I just, like, I, in high school, I kind of, like, felt like I just didn't have that thing. Like, everyone kind of did something and was, like, part of some kind of group. And I just never really felt like I had that. And then playing that show, I was like, oh, like, yeah, like, I love singing and writing. And, you know, I, I felt more placed at that point. So from then on, I just started jamming with my brother a lot more. And Roman and I, I think, played some shows together which were like and Roman's style is very like I mean he's heard Roman's music it's, you know he's that like we're different but like we come together and we create some pretty cool stuff which was fun to to like learn to compromise with his taste and you know vice versa but so that was sort of like that grew and then I remember one time I went to a show I think it was called Padlock with the venue at the time like near the BMO bank um and this band called Chatterbox was playing and a friend of mine, Eric, who was the drummer and I just like, they were playing and I was like, this is so sick. Like, I feel like they could really use female vocals. Like, that would sound so cool. Like, they kind of had like a psych rock, Tim and Paula Tim and Paul, like, kind of energy about that. And I was like, mm -hmm. I want to, so I just like went up to Eric after and I was like, can I jam with you guys? Like, have you ever thought about female vocals? Like, I feel like I love singing and like, I want to write. I want to start writing as opposed to just doing covers. So he was like sure and I went to a jam session with them and yeah I mean that was the first time that I was like oh shit like actually like jamming with a group like a full band mm -hmm. and it was so fun like jamming I remember that summer it was the summer that the fires were really really bad and but like I just remember like we jammed so much like once a week or twice a week we'd go to this jam space in west side and it was just such a like a, a maturing moment and also becoming who I felt like I was supposed to always be and like being in an element that was very that was so genuinely who I was like I wasn't pretending I wasn't trying to fit into an aesthetic like it was just like I loved singing and writing music and just like you know being in that moment and it makes me feel very present like I never felt more present than when I would be jamming or singing and yeah so played with them for the summer which was really cool. We got to play a festival, which was super cool. We went to Electric Love and I got to go for free, which was cool. And like, it was just like so many new experiences came out of it. And then, yeah, after that, I think eventually like at the end of the summer, like I, we kind of like dissipated a bit. And then I, me and two of the guys, Alex Campbell and Alex Ward, like incredibly talented people, like um, Alex Campbell plays guitar. Alex Ward plays like every instrument <laughs> um we kind of like split off and then that's when we started doing phosphines um like really starting to do phosphines was with the two of them and that's when we wrote a, like a bunch of songs together and we wrote one that one lazy daisy that like is actually like there's a few actually on band camp <laughs> um and yeah they were just so incredible like we just the three of us worked so well together and uh, we would go and jam in alex's basement and just like yeah it was just so incredible to sing and be able to sing songs that I had written and a lot of them were just like so personal literally just singing my diary almost but it was very freeing and empowering to just like be doing something that 
people could judge me so harshly for but I just like, didn't care and I just like, felt good about it and yeah and then from then on we like played a few shows together and then uh, playing at the Blue Grotto like those were big shows like that was super fun and like I remember there was one show we played at the Blue Grotto that like people were just like actually dancing and yeah it's crazy being on stage and singing and just like being like everything could go wrong I could fuck up so bad but like I'm just gonna like I had no choice it was like once you book a show once you're standing on stage all my anxieties about what could go wrong like didn't matter and I just had to like do it 